Well, it's a foggy and mild Saturday morning for us, but some big time changes are ahead in our forecast. I want to get right to the details. So over the next couple mornings, we're warm, but then a cold front comes through late on Monday, ushering in cooler air. It takes a little while for the cooler air to get here, so we have a low of 52 on your Halloween morning, so feeling cooler already, and by trick or treating time, it will feel cool and windy. And then look at these morning low temperatures for Mobile over the next few days. As we get towards midweek, we could have lows in the 30s. In fact, 38 our forecast low on your Thursday morning. Then we gradually, gradually warm up as we get towards the back half of this forecast. Average temperature 53 for our morning low, so we're going to go below that for a short period midweek next week. All this thanks to a powerful cold front that is moving our way. We're in high pressure right now, but that high pressure does dissipate, and then this cold front marches our way, gets close to us on Monday, but doesn't pass to us, pass us until later on Monday. Also something to note, a lot of the rain behind the front and the clouds as well. However, it looks like most of the rain dissipates by the time it gets to us. As we can see, this is Tuesday morning, so your Halloween morning. A couple showers possible here along with some clouds. Halloween will be windy and cloudy most likely and also very cool with a strong northerly wind. By trick or treating time, we'll keep those clouds around. It'll stay chilly and breezy. And then as we start the first day of November, appropriately cold. So as I mentioned, most of the rain chances go away with this front. Doesn't look like we're going to have any significant ones. We're keeping it only around 20% on your Halloween, most likely during the midday hours according to some of the forecast models that trick or treating forecast for you. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be chilly and quite blustery as well. A wind gusting possibly up to 25 miles per hour. So you might want to have some extra layers to the costume. Definitely if you have a cape or something, it's going to be flying around. So get ready for that. Clouds will be around. We'll go partly cloudy for most of this. However, we might have some more peaks of sun as we get into the evening hours, and then you definitely will feel the chill if you are out later in the night, especially around 9 p.m. When we drop into those mid 50s, we could even see some cooler feeling temperatures because of that wind. Well, right now it is a foggy start across the Gulf Coast. This is the current conditions this morning out of our Dolphins camera in downtown Mobile, and you can see plenty of fog. This is just a layer of fog. Remember, we're at, in Dolphins at the top of the tower, so we're dealing with looking down towards the fog and you can see it's a really cool picture there. You can see it moving as well. 68 degrees right now. Downtown Mobile. Our dense fog advisory is going to go until 9 a.m. Then we turn to just partly cloudy skies for us. Here's a look at that full day planner for today and we get warm in the afternoon. 81 degrees, very light breeze today and then getting cooler as we head towards the evening hours. 70 by 9 p.m. Then the full weekend forecast. Yeah, we don't have the changes yet, so it's still going to be warm. Temperatures in the middle 80s most likely those partly cloudy skies in the afternoon, the puffy cumulus clouds that we've been talking about for the past few days, the morning fog, then mild morning, warm afternoon. Same thing as you get to your Sunday, and that's going to last all the way through really Monday. Then we finally get some changes. All right, so taking a look at the beach forecast because it is so warm out there we have a moderate risk for rip currents for the next three days that surf right around two feet each and every day. So if you're heading down there, just make sure you're paying attention to the beach flags and uh, the posted signs down there. Make sure you know what those beach flags mean. Taking a look at your seven day outlook on Halloween, that 20% chance of a midday shower, but that's pretty much it. Starting November, much cooler temperatures in the 60s, low temperatures, very low, getting into the 30s possibly as we get towards midweek next week. So get ready for those cooler temperatures and maybe a gradual, gradual warm up towards the end of the upcoming week, but get ready for those cooler temperatures. It'll feel nice.